Hello YouTube fans. Uh, after watching uh, a lot of these everyday carry videos on YouTube and looking at everyday carry pictures, I decided to make one of my own. Uh, I don't know if anybody will find any of this stuff interesting, but this is my EDC video. First off, like everybody else, I have keys. There's my house keys, um, keys for things around the house, and my car keys. I keep them on this carom binder. Now this is a camo carom binder, but the paint has been worn off it by the keys rubbing on it. And what's nice about it is that it's actually a locking carom binder where you turn this little barrel down here and it locks it. So like if you're worried about losing your car keys, something like that, you'll, you'll never lose them with this locked. So, it's a pretty nice unit. I picked this up on Amazon. Um, it's got pretty nice action to it and everything, so I'm quite happy with that. Next up, because I have allergies and I get a lot of colds in winter, I have a snot rag. I always carry a snot rag with me every day. Um, it's also useful for other things, like a lot of times I cut myself, I need to kind of dab up the blood or something. and. Uh, I have it with me every day. iPod Touch. This is an 8 gig iPod Touch. Um, it's way too small. If I, <clears throat> This is the only one I could afford, but if I could afford the 16 gig or the 32 gig, I would have gotten it. If I ever get another one, I'm definitely going to get a bigger one because this cannot hold everything that I want to put on here. earbuds. The earbuds that come with the iPod are crap in my opinion. Um, they, they're just hard plastic and they hurt your ears. So I went to Best Buy and I got these Sony earbuds. They have, uh, I don't know if you can see them on camera here, they have like the little re removable rubber parts that you put on and they come in three different sizes and uh, I think the largest size are the one that fit me almost perfect. And you can pretty much wear these all day and they're really comfortable. So I'm pretty happy with them. They're quite expensive. I think they're like 50 bucks or something like that. But they sound great and they're really comfortable. So I'm pretty happy with them. Like most guys, I carry a pocket knife. This is uh, a Victoronix one-handed trekker. Uh, German Army version is made for the German Army under contract. It has a German Army Eagle right here on it, and it's got a locking blade, and it's got a wood saw, and bottle opener, can opener, reamer, screwdrivers, and so forth. It's got pretty much what you would need, you know, on a day-to-day -day basis for, uh, you know fixing things or whatever. If, if I needed something more than this, I would probably go with a Leatherman or whatever. And I still may get a Leatherman wave someday, but we'll see. But for now, this uh, German Army Victoronix is my everyday carry knife, and I'm pretty happy with it. This costs about $44 on Amazon. Wallet. Like most guys, I carry a wallet. This is a camel wallet that I found in... Uh, an army surplus store they had them by the counter and I picked it up and it it holds a lot of stuff it's got velcro to keep it closed I've got all my credit cards and ID and money and so forth in here I've had this for quite a while I believe it's made out of nylon it's it's several years old and it still looks like new yet so it's a very nice wallet coin purse when I have change, I don't like it rattling around in my pocket loose. So I have this, I just picked up this zippered camel coin purse. Um, it's made by a company called Manhattan Portage that I had not heard of before, but apparently they're a fairly well established company. They make messenger bags and backpacks and other big bags like that. And it's just uh, kind of a neat little zippered pouch. I tried to fit the iPod in here, but it doesn't quite fit, but it would have been cool if I could have got one of these for the iPod, but it didn't quite make it. Watch. I've had many, many watches over the years, both mechanical and quartz. I've had a Rolex. I've had many, many watches. I have G-Shocks and so forth, but I always seem to come back to this Timex. 
This is a Timex 8-lap Ironman triathlon with a Velcro strap. Uh, this is based on the original Ironman design from 1986. And it, it's just a basic digital watch. It gives you the time, the day, date, has stopwatch functions and so forth. Very light, comfortable watch. It's very accurate. Um, I really like it a lot, and I wear it every day. Uh, and I do recommend it, although I don't believe it's available anymore. You may, you may still find it online. It's difficult to say. And last, a hat. I'm an old guy, and most of my hair is taking a hike, so I wear a hat. This is a black patrol cap that I bought on Amazon. Um, it's a very cool-looking hat, I think. It uh, fits me really well. And one thing nice about it is that it's adjustable. It has a Velcro adjustment here, which, which many of them don't have. Usually you have to just get your right size, but this one is adjustable, so uh, you can adjust it just to fit perfectly. And it's a really nice hat, and I really recommend it. So that's about it. Um, if you have any questions or comments about any of my EDC items, feel free to ask. Uh, I may be reviewing some of these. I, the watch has already been reviewed, and I may be uh, reviewing some items, like maybe the headphones or whatever, at a later date. So any questions, feel free to ask them, and thanks for watching my review.